We introduced you to a hairdresser turned artist in part of our In the Spotlight series. Now, when she moved to Fort Wayne not too long ago, she embarked on showcasing the diversity here in 21 Country. Sharing the story of her Russian heritage and love of portraits, her latest project, Unity with Variety, opened in a very special way over the weekend. I love painting people. I have a passion for that. Typically, artwork hangs from the Jeffrey R. Kroll Gallery at the downtown Allen County Library. But the first guests of its newest exhibit saw this. Behind all these fabric draped stars, there are paintings, and we're going to see them today. And reveal <laughs> after reveal. After reveal, familiar faces hanging from the wall. Since I'm a recent transplant here, I felt like I wanted to know what cultures were actually living in Fort Wayne, and I was pleasantly surprised to find so many different ones here. 50 paintings, 50 cultures, and 50 people, all out in 21 country. I was 28 years when I came to this country. And uh, we, had, we were a family, my husband and I, and we had a child. We came because of uh, school. Showcasing personality and traditional dress. The crown represents, the top part of the crown represents the peacock. And then the spine of the crown represents dragon. And the entrance of the crown actually is the, the entrance of the temple. And the rest of the costume is basically, it's a 19th century Burmese Last Kingdom of Burma um, ornament. It's a traditional clothing for any Hossa man um, who is married and um, down south in South Africa. Many seeing their likeness turned into art for the first time. This is something new. I've never had a, port a portrait of myself made, so this is something new. and. It looks, it looks beautiful actually. I think I might actually obtain it. <laughs> it was funny because certain ones spoke to me and said they had to have some mixed media elements. So if somebody had a sparkly top on or something, I felt like maybe I would add a few little jewels to that and it sort of fit their culture. Sometimes the painting tells me what it needs to be, what kind of medium it needs to be painted in. Bringing people together to show there can really be unity with variety. We came in 57, and Fort Wayne was not like this now, you know. Diversity. I love diversity, and I would, if I could take a little part in it, you know, I, I wanted to. I was astonished by Hillary's vibes and able to translate and transform our inner thoughts and energy and messages and out to the public. We are a human race, and we are to just get well with one another and get on together. I hope that for the most important thing that I bring out is their joy, and then hopefully there's an essence that comes through the painting that makes it uniquely them. If you have time to check it out, there's an additional audio component where you can scan a QR code and listen to each subject tell you a little bit about themselves. You can see that exhibit through November 12th. We've put links to more information, including about the artist, on our website, WPTA21.com.